Still struggling with Homecoming's uh, protagonist, huh? Yeah, yeah. I'm going through male first names in my head. What? Look at that Japan! Yeah, look at it. It's gross. Is it coming under the- Oh! Door? By the way, it's insanely strong. I cannot physically okay. kill it. Luckily, it loves blood. Give me the blood! Go over there, idiot! And it's like, oh yeah, blood. Yeah. I love that stuff! Oh, I love it. Oh. Even though it's a human, you literally have tons of blood. So what I love is that the uh, the fucking goddamn thing we got here, you know, the Alice in Wonderland shit, yeah. nothing to do with the puzzle. Of course not. Couldn't have less. All right, I believe that's it for this floor, right? Pa -pa 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 -pa. Oh, the door to my right. Oh, and it was open all along. Come yeah, at me, yeah. fuckers. Go into ready stance. <gasps> So the reason why this thing says it's hard to use, by the way, is because unlike almost every other weapon, you can't move and uh, swing. Mm -hmm. However, who the fuck needs it? Enemies come to you anyway. There's a liner. Ah, oh, fuck. I just remembered a huge plot point of, of Homecoming. Because his family name is really strong in the, in the, See? In the town. See? See? And he's like, his, his, his family is like one of the founding families of the town, yeah? Hold on one second. We need okay. to do this puzzle. Uh, so that's white, white, blue, orange, green, white, blue, orange, green, violet, yellow, black, Unavoidable red. sleeping time. Okay, so you know, I'm that just gonna color. do these. So white, blue, orange, green. I'm gonna do them one at a time, you know, one group at a time. White, blue, orange, green. All right, come on, brother. Oh, I have to just use them, okay. Just slap them in So there. white, blue, orange, white, blue. You don't have a white one. Oh, I got a blue one. Where are my ones already? There? White, know. blue. Nailed it. You can tell I did a good job. Orange. Yeah. Then it's uh, it's uh, yeah, it's dandelions. And then it's blood flowing from a slashed wrist. Yeah. Which, even though it's kind of pink and lavender. See? It's not quite bright red. Whatever, we're in there. Plus, the colors are a little washed. Oh, now. shit. Oh, it's Nurses. Oh, yeah, motherfucker. Oh. Did you see that hitbox? That was crazy. That's ridiculous. Fuck, put this guy in Marvel. Put any. Oh. <laughs> put anyone in Marvel. Put my anyone. We're taking oh. anybody. All covers. Wait, why is it so strong? It's doing better than it did before. Uh, because the, the blue ones are weaker. Oh, right, right, right. Also, I think I'm getting headshots. That's that big headshot. Fuck yeah. Alright, so all you nurses here at, uh... uh Alchemilia. <laughs> Al Al Alchemical Drive, uh, hospital. Mm -hmm. So, who are the toughest among you? The, the couple raised their hand. Alright, you're gonna be wearing the blue, okay? And the other girls wear the green if you're not- if you're weak. You have it backwards, Matt. It's fine. I don't know- Is this a trick you're playing on the murder nurses? I'm a weird doctor with a fetus on his back. I don't know what I'm doing. Not to be confused with Dr. Fetus from, uh, Super Meat Boy. Right. Who is just all fetus in, in a, a jar. While. Fucking I love the grimy industrial- Man, I fucking, fucking give up on that motherfucker's name. You wanna- you want a fucking hint? Yes. The last name of the character is Shepard. Shepard, yeah. Okay. Did that help at all? Give me a minute. His brother's name is Josh. Alex. There you go. Why did that help? Why that clue? I don't know. I don't know. Oh, man. Alex Shepard. Homecoming. So memorable. So I can fucking memorable. Murphy. Pendleton. Murphy Pendleton's a weird fucking name for losers. I don't blame you. Nah, Is that a jar of milk? Man. It's a disinfectant jar of milk. Works for me. Oh, fuck. She's not even bothering you. you yeah, too bad. To. She's gotta go. She doesn't. Unless she's hiding in night. Oh, right? yeah! Oh. oh! Oh! No! No, Matt. What? We have somebody who'll use that shit against us nearby. Careful. Oh! No, he's doing it again. 
Now he's doing it on purpose. The lock is slam jammed. I fucking wish! Man, that cracked. What the hell? Why, that health why did I get like a crackly teenage voice thinking about Space Jam? Bars. There you go. Fuck, I, I was going through my old PS PS uh, one games. We have a Space Jam game on the PSX. Are you serious? Yeah, I completely That's forgot all? about. That's great. I think it's just a cartoony sports game, but because it, it'd be cool if it was like an adventure game. Mm -hmm. Oh, like you mean like you things. mean like Barkley shut up in Jam Gaiden? Something like that. <sighs> Did I get the whole third floor? Yeah. Did I get the whole second floor? Yeah. Did I get the whole first floor? Did you no, because I can't, you can't. But I did get the key to the basement storeroom, which... You know, if you just nuke the, uh, hospital... It's it probably... More than enough to kill anything that moves. Nuke. It's really powerful. Especially against living things. Yeah, Barry! It's a fucking acid grenade. I'd love to be a fly on the wall of like whoever translated RE1 specifically. Just it be was like, Shinji Mikami. What? Yeah, maybe. Yeah. Especially kids. That's a line we don't quote nearly as much. We quote everything else. Oh man, I love that it's really powerful, especially against living things. And it's also it's that I like. You know, it's like you think about certain voice actors or people that were. Um, a small part of a game, but they went on to be, like, the most important part. That's correct. Like, who's the most important part of Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde on the NES? The guy that posed for the art on the box. Right. Right? And Barry, the voice actor for Barry, is literally the most important person that had anything to do with Resident Evil 1. I mean, you could, you could make that claim, yeah? I guess. I, well, because he's got all the stupidest lines. Yeah. So where is that guy today, and does he know... Does he know? So you remember guys see he was like, yeah, I kind of thought it would be a game, but I didn't really know anything until like 10 years later. Yeah, now he's a fucking cult megastar. Yeah, we didn't know. It's like a I, hallway underneath the grate. But he knows now. But does the fucking voice actor for Barry know? Probably Let not. us know. Let us know in the comments. The voice actor for Barry knows what's what. Someone contact him. He's also a motion, he's a live action actor in that in that game also, so... Really? Yeah, remember at the very beginning, it's a live-action intro? Yeah, no, but it's the act- that actor yeah, played Yeah, of course! Wow. Because they did voice- I, I thought think. they just dubbed over. Oh, maybe they did. Oh, look! Like father, like daughter! Chemicals! He's a big, dumb scientist! He almost burnt his ball hair off. Oh, I never quite realized the- the- the motif of ha the fact that you have to burn your way into this part of the hospital. Right? Because we're gonna get some fire shit in a minute. Fire now, this good. part sucks. You know why it sucks? Why does it suck? Because you don't have a map to this place. I don't have the map to this place. Which means I gotta do it the like, hard way. I don't have the map to this place. And then he looks down in his hands, he's like, oh, I actually do. I, oh. I, I thought I, I didn't. Wow! That was brutal because it was like through her kneecap. Oh, yeah. So it's one of those things that it's like a felt marker would power our hero substantially. You know what's really messed up? Why are Silent Hill 2 nurses in the latter games, even though they have messed up horrible faces, how come they're like a thousand times sexier than these relatively normal nurses? Well, because they don't have fucking horrible growths coming out of their backs. They also, are you talking about the bobblehead nurses? Yeah. They're horrific. What are you talking about? I don't know. They're specifically designed about used condoms about to burst. I, I guess you're more squeamish. Than oh I. shit! They finally got through my defenses. Oh shit! Yeah, because you're fucking swinging the hammer, so they got time now. All right, let's try this again. Now. Uh, what the fuck is this crap? Oh. Oh. What? Just give up, man! The hitboxes have betrayed me! Just reset the PS3 now! You mean PS1? Sure. Because we always record on the legit! On. We don't even need to say that with this. Oh no! <laughs> <laughs> oh no. Oh, my giant, my giant vagina flesh bag that's underneath my skirt. Ah! 
What the fuck? Stop doing that! It's the cheapest thing possible! Because it's, it's whenever you load into an area, you don't expect a thing to happen right off the bat after loading, so... Gotcha. A videotape. Smash it with the hammer. That's important. That's one of the reasons I came down here. I suppose that was another belt that was on the yeah, that back one. Yeah, just a belt, man. Just a belt. You could use it. Anyone can use a backup belt just in case. Sometimes... Uh, I have a I have a substantial fear of falling out of my bed, which is asinine because I don't even move when I sleep. Also, you sleep in a closet, so I don't sleep in What's a closet. This? Mm. We'll see. Uh, Looks like someone's been here. As opposed to the other rooms. There she be. It's a good. That's a good piece of art. <laughs> Does it say on the computer console, do it for her? Yeah. <laughs> Alessa. Oh, I yeah, want the key, her. motherfucker. No, you want the picture. Oh, wait, listen. This is a, like a really, really, really fucked up version of like one of the first themes that happens when you get to Silent Hill uh, originally. Like a, like, like the beginning, but this is also the beginning. Okay, no. Think about it. Um, if I go to a hospital and they have like an old, like turn of the century style key to open up a door and not like a control panel mm -hmm. or like one of the electronic locks, mm -hmm. I'd be like, I think I can afford a better hospital than this. Too bad your taxes paid for it. This Damn is what it. You get. That's what you get, motherfucker. Well, uh, ours would. Yeah. But I mean, Harry. Wow, look at this. I know, right? Jesus. This is one of the first games I can think of that used camera angles for a purpose. Yeah, RE one camera like original RE one, like not not remake. Let like, me let didn't me, have camera angles as stylish as that. Oh, let me actually change that because RE one obviously had camera angles, right? And so did Alone in the Dark. But, but like yeah, no. what I what I mean is like like there are pants in rooms that are clearly designed like that that hallway at the very beginning. Like the camera is a character here where it yeah, usually yeah, yeah. isn't. It's usually just a. It's usually a passive tool. passerby that doesn't really have much to add. Oh man! Yeah. So, tell you what. Okay, so I have the key to the examination room. Now, should I go there or should I go watch that video first? Mm, why don't you watch that video? Yeah. Make my video, make, make them out like shout. Luckily, I killed everything, so there's nothing to stop me. What if the blood moon shows up? Well, then, well, this would be appropriate for the blood moon. Yeah. God. Now I'm starting to remember that fucking evil box that chased you in, in Downcoming. The evil red box that chased you and just caused damage. Oh! Wow, I super forgot what you were talking about. Yeah. Like the orb? Yeah, okay, orb, sure. Oh! Never yeah, really it kind of was like an evil box. <laughs> it didn't it like have anything Fuck, to do- Fuck, that's stupid as shit! Did it not have anything to do with- Oh, it had- it was like your guilt or whatever. <laughs> oh. But only in that area. Only in the- only in the nightmare zones. Guilt zones. Oh, that's fucking Guilt stupid. Guilt shit. Let's watch this video. Oh, but it's like Marky Mark. Okay, well, the plot was a little thin. I didn't really understand the first act of that. I didn't really get the part with the video. So was he- w were they with that guy? Oh, man. 
Oh, that one's- How that, did they know to kill that, him? That question is like the most real, infuriating question ever. Yeah. Who- wait, weren't they with that guy? Weren't they his friend? Why'd they shoot that I, guy? I, I think, uh, were they with that guy is like, specifically Jerry Seinfeld had a book. Like, I think in and around when Seinfeld was still on, and one of his jokes in the book was like, yeah, you go see a theater, and like, the most common question you get, you know those types of people you go to the theater, and you like them, but in a movie theater, they're fucking dreadful? Yes. And that was the question. Like, I know many people with, like this. Weren't they with that guy? Yeah. They, Why did he shoot that they, guy? I don't know. Either I don't know, or because they betrayed them is always the answer. Those are the key emotions. That always. Betrayal. Let's go into the examination room. There's no two sequels that are more different than each other than Mission Impossible 1 and Mission Impossible 2. You're right. Where one has an almost unpenetrable... Plot. And the other I have one found has, something to examine. And the other one has zero plot. Hello. <laughs> that was fucking creepy. Finally, someone else who's okay. I never said I was okay. Who are you? My name's Lisa Garland. What's yours? I'm Harry. Harry Mason. Harry Mason. Harry's so much Harry, more confident than what's James. Happening here. Where is Even though he's everybody? also like quite yeah. unsure, but he's like, he, at I least he knows who he is. Out. When I came to, everyone was gone. It's awful. So you don't know anything either. So it's it is Great. important to note that she's in the same room that you find Kaufman. Mm. I just don't get it. It's like this is all some kind of bad dream. Hell yeah, it is. Yeah, a living nightmare. Sure is. Let me ask you, have you seen a little girl around here? Short, black hair. Short, black hair, seven years old. Oh, man. No, but I saw a, a gruff, hunchbacked, seven-foot-tall little girl. With a knife. Yes. A seven-year-old girl. I saw an eight-year-old. I didn't see a seven-year-old. I can't say that I have. I was unconscious all this time. I'm sorry. So she has a red shirt. That must That's mean she's right. the toughest nurse, nurse of all, yeah? That's right. Do you know anything about all that weird stuff in the basement? No. She's like, that stuff wasn't mine. Why? I actually think it's supposed to make there? her look sexy. Yeah, probably. Like, to you denote know? that... Like, she's the sexy nurse. Red, red heels, too, yeah. is the strong. We're under strict orders never to enter the basement storeroom. Never. So I really don't know. What did you say was down there? Some f shit. Shit, oh, no, I don't even want it's... to talk about it. <clears throat> oh. Damn. My head. What's wrong? Harry? She backs Harry. it up, back it up. Hello? He's like, ugh, I feel so much better. Where's my wallet? Was I dreaming? You were too late. It's you. Fuck you, bitch. You old witch. Literally. Yes, Dahlia Gillespie. It's me, Mama Pasta. Tell me everything you know. What's going on? Darkness. <laughs> darkness imprisoning me. All that I see. By darkness. Go see the Punisher, November His November seventeenth. All that Netflix. Petty desire, childish sleep talk. Bitch, what the fuck are you come. talking about? How dare you, you break into my about? private hospital room? Everything you say in the original you game is total nonsense. Believe the evidence of the your eyes. In this town, that is your destination. Okay. This is beyond. Trust my in the strength so of your elbow. You can stop it now. That looks like a sucker. Yeah. Have you not seen like a the crest marked on the ground all over town? No. <laughs> so I did, but I, I passed it off as bad graffiti. Boy, it's some bad graffiti. What does it mean? It is the mark of Samael. No, it's not. Don't let it be completed. 
No, it's not in that she's wrong, or hey, no, it's wait. not in that's a mistranslation. It's not what it is at all. A little bit of both. Nice. That's so for some reason they call it Samael, though, even though the the day de the demon oh. yeah. that um, you constantly see in Silent Hill is Baphomet. It's the it's it's the very classic goat demon right, man. Right, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, Samael's not that. Uh. And Samael is like an angel sounding name, I think. But yeah, uh, also, weird. it is also not the mark of Samael. It's a different, I'm, sh I'm it's a, sure it's a different fucking Some thing. edgy variant of Samael appears in the Dark Side. Oh, yeah, look at this somewhere. edgy thing. Oh, these are not rotating around. I gotta do this the hard way. Oh, boy. Oh, All right. Geez, this is LP cancel. Oh, fuck. I can't rotate? I can't. I, well, I have to rotate manually. That's the tough part. Yeah. That's the really. Life's garbage. Please don't be dark. All right. Well, sounds like <sighs> dogs are running up to you. So she gives me a fairly vague. Wait, what? Wow, that's fucking pixelated as shit. Yeah, she gives me a fairly vague piece of advice. God, I'd hate to go too old silent. Well, that is a horrible noise. Um, which is find the other church in this town. But before that, we're actually going to head to the, the police station. Police! Ha <laughs> ha! Hilarious. Now... Oh, I fucking hate that. God I think you had an animal buddy to help you against the uh, skinless dogs. Yeah. Alright, let's go to the police station. Why? Because there's a shit ton of ammunition there. Yeah, I think a, a minigun, I believe. Uh, I believe that might actually be one of the New Game Plus weapons. Not a minigun. I was just messing around. So as you can tell, there are new radio noises. Good. Awful. Awful sounding radio the one, noises. The thing that's happening right now is not, is not great. Or, it just stopped. But. So there And are that <laughs> is just a human, like, character model with a bag text. Oh! No! Get off me, That's motherfucker! That's not a great enemy. I hate these guys. <laughs> uh, so weirdly... Like monkey guys? Oh, fuck! Wow. They're not in the game a lot. Um... Like, you, you see them here and there. They're just homeless people. <laughs> so what's goofy is that... The police station is the kind of area that you would expect there to be, like, a shit ton of gameplay inside. No. It's completely optional. Huh. Couldn't be more optional. Wow, did she really just... Did I not do everything at Alcamilla? What do you expect? I mean, you mean the fact that the red marker is still on? It means... I picked the fucking key up, right? Ah! Antique... Oh, right, look. Antique cop. The green lion. Yeah. So I'm supposed to scrounge it. Ah, oh, okay. Look, I did it. I fucking did it. So is that it, or can you go? Okay, good. Yeah, no, you can go a little bit. Man, I hope they make an Umbrella Chronicle style game for Silent Hill. They did. It's called Silent Hill Arcade. No, but like one that that's its own that's its own game. You're right. I I got want, a note, I by want the, way. the premium adventure. Would you like to read this note? Uh, sure. Coroner seals called. Officer Gucci is unlikely to be unlikely to be murdered. He apparently died naturally. That's a fucking mistake. That's supposed to be is unlikely to have been murdered. murdered. But medical reports show Officer Gucci had no prior symptoms of heart disease. Wow. Take that, Gucci. Gucci's corpse is like, oh man, am I embarrassed? Oh boy, I'm I'm strongly embarrassed right now. So bad. I saved the game at police. So that's supposed to be our little hint that uh, the cult or whatever is actually more powerful than the cops. Mm. All right. So the only real way is that's to rough. Yeah, we're gonna hit a left, and then take a big fucking left, and that's pretty much the the path all the way there. Watch out for the monkey boys. Yeah, they're terrible. They can move faster than you in some circumstances. Like if you run in a straight line. Luckily, Serpentine. They like through all this bullshit. That will confuse them. Serpentine is the shit. I hate that fucking noise. As you get closer to your destination, um, yeah, it, I would imagine it increases in its annoying potency. Pitch. 
So we're going to be running on the right side of the street because we're going to be passing the town center. Which is just which another is not, fancy word for fun. a fucking mall. Not sure why they call it the town center. Like, like a bunch of town center mall would be fine. Yeah. But, uh. It's like that mall in Hamilton. The abandoned scary one. Oh yeah, shit! Yeah, yeah. There's one. There's one mall that's fine, and then there's the other mall. <laughs> oh man. Let's go in here. The mall that time forgot. I got the antique shop key. Fucking dope. Use the shit out of it. Let's do it. Very proud. Yeah. Shit. Shit. Okay. Okay. What time is it? Nothing special. It's quarter past ten. Let's save the game in the antique shop, which is supposedly the other church. We pray at the antique shop. The god of antiques smiles down upon us. Oh, shit. Somebody move that fucking cabinet. No, I don't. Nope, too bad, Matt. We're pushing it. No, I mean, I mean, Harry would say that. Like, it's know. like, oh, I'm fucking tired, man. I really man. feel like... It I... has been a long-ass day. I ran all the way from the fucking hospital. Harry! Shooter! 